Good evening, world. Allow me first to apologize for this interruption. I do, like many of you, appreciate the comforts of the everyday routine, the security of the familiar, the tranquility of repetition. I enjoy them as much as any bloke. But in a spirit of commemoration, whereby those important events of the past, usually associated with someone's death or the end of some awful struggle, are celebrated with a nice holiday. I thought we could mark this July 30th, by taking some time out of our daily lives, to go out and spread the message of Operation Onslaught. There are, of course, those who do not want us to launch this operation. I suspect even now orders are being shouted into telephones and men with little to no understanding of Anonymous will soon be on the internet searching for anything relevant to Anonymous or this operation. Why? Because while the truncheon may be used in lieu of conversation, words will always retain their power. Words offer the means to meaning and for those who will listen, the enunciation of truth. And the truth is, there is something terribly wrong with this country, isn't there? And where once you had the freedom to object, to think and speak as you saw fit, you now have sensors and systems of surveillance, coercing your conformity and soliciting your submission. How did this happen? Who's to blame? Well certainly there are those who are more responsible than others, and they will be held accountable. But again, truth be told if you're looking for the guilty, you need only look into a mirror. I know why you did it. I know you were afraid. Who wouldn't be? War. Terror. Disease. There were a myriad of problems, which conspired to corrupt your reason, and rob you of your common sense. Fear got the best of you and in your panic, you turned to your governments. They promised you order. They promised you peace. And all they demanded in return was your silent, obedient consent. Our hope is to remind the world that fairness, justice and freedom are more than words, they are perspectives. So if you've seen nothing, if the crimes of these governments remain unknown to you, then I will suggest that you allow the 30th of July to pass unmarked. But if you see, what I see, if you feel as I feel, and if you would seek as I see, then, you two are anonymous. The objective is simple. Spread the word that Anonymous is here, and we are a force to be reckoned with by posting flyers, stickers, tags, etc. across your cities. Anyone participating in online ops will be hitting Twitter, Facebook, YouTube and MySpace. Print flyers, or make your own. Get stickers or print your own at home. Get your stencils ready and the paint to go with it. Hit major centers across your city the world is your canvas, and spread the message the freedom is alive in all of us and Anonymous is here, to make sure the people are heard. Let everyone know that change is on the way. Let everyone know. We are not pirates, we are not longer hackers in our mother's basement, we are your neighbors, your co-workers, your family and your friends. We are, omnipresent. We are Anonymous. We are Legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Expect us.